Nice to meet you. Hi, I'm Jody. Nice to meet you too. How are you feeling? Um, a tad bit nervous because I don't know what to expect. But I mean, that's um, fair enough. Yeah. Fair enough, fair enough. Um, well, you look really nice. Thank you. Well dressed. You look little decent too. I'll <laughs> <laughs> follow your lead. How do you feel about that? I follow your lead. You want to follow my lead? All right, no problem. Well. All right, so I see some questions here, but I think I'm going to just ask you from there. Sure. So um, you said your name is Josh? Yeah. Josh. So what do you do for fun, Josh? I mean, fun is a complex topic when you do what I do. But average day, I'm an adventure guy. So on an average day, leave the Ochi, come back the next week. If I'm not at work, what about you? Um, I'm adventurous too. Uh, I like to try new things. I'm a foodie, as much as my manga. <laughs> I love my belly. Uh, so I like to go to restaurants, try new food. I like to travel the island too. I mean, and travel otherwise. I mean, fair enough. Uh, three truths and a lie. Three truths and a lie. All right. Uh, I am a teacher. I am a dancer. I love alcohol. I wear glasses. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you give me dancer vibes. You have really nice eyes, so probably they are not really good. So thank you, thank you. Yeah, um, alcoholic. No, you're not really give me alcohol vibes. Uh, teacher, definitely. Really? Yeah. Okay. So which was the truth? Which was the lie? Which was the lie? Mm -hmm. I'm a dancer. Really? I'm not a dancer. I mean, we can work on that. We can <laughs> definitely work on that. I can do a little thing, you know. But, but you know, no, 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 big, big dance. Uh, yeah, go for a stage and tour and everything. Um, so for me, three truths and a lie. Um, cats are my favorite animal. One, mm -hmm. I'm a teacher. I'm a lawyer. I think kids are the greatest thing to ever grace this earth. Wow. Okay. So you said teacher. Yeah, teacher, lawyer. lawyer. Cats are my favorite cats thing. Cats are my favorite. And, and children are the greatest are, thing to grace the earth. Wow, you know, look teachery. <laughs> you know, <laughs> you know, look liar either. So I'm going to go with you are uh, the lie is your uh, teacher. That is actually one of the truths. Yeah, and um, the liar one, don't it? That's actually a truth too. For I mean, you? I'm scared of cats. Don't use it against me. <laughs> but yeah, and I'm I'm actually afraid of. Like animals in general, mm -hmm. cat, dog, everything. I mean, dog yeah, yeah. on a different day, but uh, mm -hmm. I'm scared of cats. Like, run from cat and everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I mean, it 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 is it is what it is. Let's start small. All right, no problem. Why are you single? Uh, I have a number of reasons. Specifically, because I feel like a lot of people aren't loyal right now. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm a real one. I'm a loyal You're a real one. one. I mean, everybody thinks they're the real no, one. No, I'm, I'm a real one. Okay. I don't so, think everybody thinks so, do you know? Mm -hmm. I don't think everybody thinks What does a real one look like to you, though? When they're loyal, they're honest. You know, they don't go behind your back and do things or, you know, lying, holy for lying. And I'm just, you know, All right. cool, cool, feel cool. like one person is good enough and work with that. Nice. I mean, I think what I'm saying is that I'm perfect and everybody else is the problem. So, I mean, I think that's... that's Did you just say I'm perfect? I mean, as far as perfect goes, I, I don't, um, I, I, I'm, I'm kidding. Oops. I'm kidding. I don't think many are the perfect box. But I think why I'm single is I'm busy. I mean, I mm -hmm. tell myself that. Okay. Um, so, maybe that's why. Well, the pandemic, I mean, it's been three years of pandemic. 
So maybe that's why. say you go out, like you go OT and you go movie and you know something. Yeah, but you now find a girl at OT. Why? What she, what she have girl? It's the thing for me now. I have to know it. So, I see you. You look good, yeah. Mm. But then what? I mean, yeah, most girls look good. Person, you look good. You, look, you see them look good, so you go and you say, oh. I mean, all right, don't get me wrong, most girls look good. Most girls look face good. Face-wise, you know, with all that jazz, face-wise. Most girls look good, but it's the attitude behind it. True. Or really, what on the back? So you don't go out and like, you see a girl and you go to her and like, oh, hello, hello. All right, I think, I think, I think all right, you see, in this day and age, approaching females is a, is, a, is a complicated thing. All right, so you approach a girl. First of all, you have to make sure that she feel like you're not attacker. I don't know, females are always on the defensive. Maybe rightly so, maybe not. Uh, it all depends. A girl in our group, that's a definite no. So a girl in our Lord group of friends, that's oh, so a no for me. I don't approach females. I don't approach women when they're with friends. Okay. I don't approach uh, girls who seem like they don't want to be approached. And a lot of women are unapproachable. But I, I definitely, you know, shoot my shot when the time is right. Okay. So I wrote this question because I thought it was important. And it's been a deal breaker for me many times. How do you feel about a guy with a girl best friend? I have no problem with that. Because sure? I, I have male best friends. No, well, no, I mean, you're sure, friend. sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I mean, a girl best friend, they're like, come on your yard type vibes. You know, and come on your yard? In, yeah, and come, come for the one home. And in <laughs> your bed. <laughs> you know what I mean? And your mother know her. No, 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 that's gone too far. Ah, if you have a, a, no, but you know, your girl best friend, you're in a relationship. There are certain boundaries that you have to set with mm -hmm. your girl best friend. I'm not saying not to have a girl. All you right. have some people who say, no, you know, I have no girl with best friend. Mm -hmm. All right. right, so what would a respectable boundary look like for a guy with a girl best friend? Like, I mean, you know, just text and call each other if you know, go one and two, ten, fine. But to come to your house and into your bed? Um, <laughs> I mean, it's a no from me. So it's a no for you? It's a no from me. So it's a guy with a girl best friend, it's a no for you. All right, cool. I mean, that kind of got to have some insecurity thing. We are touching our background there, so. <laughs> but. So you would be fine with a girl having a boy best friend and you come I mean, to her house in her bed? All right. That kind of different, no. <laughs> kind of different, no. All right. It all depends on where you know the guy from. You know what I mean? Because girls love everybody and the best friend when they meet them in a the 3 you know? Oh, no. So it all depends on how long you know them. Oh. Touch a little deeper question with Mr. Right, yes, What are your views on homosexuality? or in general sexuality? Right, so homosexuality, I grew up in the church. Mm -hmm. So I definitely feel like that's wrong. Mm -hmm. I don't think, you know, that should be a thing. But I mean, to each his own, if somebody wants to be. I, I tend to be scared of girls yourself. Why? To each his own. I mean, it's your life. If you want to be a homosexual, then you can be a homosexual. But just don't push it on me. I mean, after all of this time, 2021, uh, I don't really feel them coming there. Chocolate chip cookie. You know what I mean? Oreo. Lay. And water. And water. And bun. Alright. All right. Not bad. <laughs> Alright. Um, why a bun though? I mean, that's kind of very significant <laughs> still. To be honest, I just feel like all men like bun. They can't go wrong with bun. <laughs> I mean, I, I mean, first date, you give me a bun. I mean, that's that 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 kind of set the pace. Uh -huh. You know what I mean? Um, so chocolate chip cookies. Why the chocolate chip cookies? Because my old friend girl, we can at least be a cookie. You know what I mean? So we can uh, say, yo, set the pace. Yeah. You can you can at least need to learn how to even be a cup of cookie for the house and the kids. <laughs> for the kids. Yeah. Okay. I'm like cookies still. That no bad. Cran water over water, why? Because you want something like a flavor, you know, just want like a dry water. So, I mean, it's something go, flavorful. I mean, yeah, I'm go for water because you know, a girl when I drink water is a red flag. <laughs> so, if you never like water, like, I mean, know far that go. water is fine. I drink water on a daily, you know, so yeah. I don't I don't mind. I don't really like, I'm trying to cut back on my sweets, so why? 
Why? Yeah, I'm because sure I eat a lot of sweets. Eat a lot of sweets. You know, I'm not health related problems. Free food. Oh, no. All right. Not bad. All right. So, question number one if you were to be a food item, what would it be? Um, tacos. A taco. You know, hard on the outside, the hard, the hard shell taco. Hard oh. on the outside, nice in the, on the inside. Oh, you know, deep. full of a lot of flavor, a lot of mix up, mix up. You know? Yeah, so that'd be a taco. I mean, I think it would be a coconut. I mean, coconut consider a food still. I think coconut but is coconut the food. coconut don't taste as good as a taco. Taco tastes good. Yeah, but coconut grow naturally. You know what I mean? Somebody Points. have to make you. I think in and of itself, why I choose coconut? Because I believe say, yo, I can grow myself. And I don't want to get me. can drink something and eat something. <laughs> so I kind of feel coconut have a good vibe to be a food. OK, so that, that's your own the coconut? I mean, yeah, why not? All right. Uh, I mean, coconut kind of blast you, but all right, make up yourself. <laughs> all right, have you ever been in a relationship with somebody who can't cook? I don't think so, no. no. I mean, I have a story to tell you, still. Like, so, I really, really hope she doesn't see this. But, like, my, my ex, when I tell you which line she fought, like, she couldn't even cook rice. <laughs> I mean, it was a sad story. Right? I Wait, mean, that, was when, that was when you were, like, really young or, like, you know, in the I mean, I thought about, you know, the last two years, I mean, the girl FaceTime her mother and her auntie, and she didn't always help her cook rice. I mean, that was it for me. That's not safe. Not at all. So, so she can't I, cook then, if she can't cook rice, right? I mean, I, I mean I'm a bridge in that room at the time. I mean, my place bridge in the day. And she cooked rice and one tin of sardine. It was the worst. <laughs> I mean, that was the worst but experience. I, drop. I mean, after that, the relationship went on a steady decline. And it was just the rice and sardine, you know, it. But I mean, if you can cook, you can teach her or let her learn. I mean, I'm not in the build up, I'm not in the build up be type of behavior. Mm, maybe all of we grow from one to ten, from the same age. Maybe see why I mean, if you learn how to cook rice and you can't cook rice. But That's sad though. It's someone who can work on. Exactly, you can work on cooking skills if you want her to be a chef. You just make sure you watch some YouTube video. I mean, or watch her mother cook or something. I, I mean, know. fair enough. Fair enough. Yeah. Um, all right, back to the snacks. As you say, bun. Yeah, you, you I said told you about the bun. bun. Uh, I got you like lays or something. Yeah, I, I mean, I, it's okay. I don't really, to be honest, I'm not really a snack snack person. I mean, from the snacks that I gave you, like what, 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 what's one deduction that you'd say about me? That's one thing that's telling about the snacks that I chose. I feel like it's nuts. You don't have snack taste. I yeah, already, already. First of all, mm -hmm. I wouldn't choose lace for you just because the bag too empty. So I'm going to say to myself, say, no, I'm going to go on something for pulling belly. The bun, <laughs> that's why I'm going to choose the bun too, you know, because it's going like to pull your belly. I mean, that's right. You can't buy right, somebody's right, lace right. because I'll be your ear. Nothing not in the bathroom here. I mean, you're right. I'm going to take Fruits. that. Fruits. And then water with the, without looking for flavor and stuff. I don't like water, but I could have put a little flavor in. Into I mean. It. You know, like a cran water. Works. That, 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 you're right, you're right. I guess that's a great compliment. <laughs> you know, the blonde yeah. and the bold. And you remember when I told you that I'm, I'm skinny, but I love my belly. So, I like things that pull up and yeah, pull my belly and so. So, I guess that's something I've got to take away from me then. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Do snack shopping. So let's just stop beating on the bushes. Do you think you'd date me? Um, all right, so yeah, you have a nice personality and everything. So yes, I think I could just to get in where you're better. Um, stuff like that. There's one thing though that I definitely don't like. What's that? The earrings. I don't like a man with, with earrings. With board ears or whatever you want to call it. Yeah. I mean, if you don't like me, if you don't like my earrings, you can't like me. Really, it's 2021 and you really have to sit down and Saying that I'm airing. Looking past that, your personality seems cool and them look us up there. So, yeah. I mean, as so, it relates to you. What about me? I would definitely date you, but you know, you have some quirks that I think we need to talk about. Um, mm, my earrings, judgment pass number one, you know. Not a judgment pass, it's I just mean, I don't like it. So. I mean, what do you think I look like? 
Um, I'm not going to try it and show you. I mean, yeah. just bear in mind that I'm not an artist. I think art is the only thing I ever fail <laughs> in my life. That's yeah, fine. I feel like I have a little round face, like I have them little scriggly ear. <laughs> But like yeah, I mean, you know right, so what do you think about like tattoos and stuff like that? Tattoos, um, I don't mind tattoos, just not too much. So what like, what what about the earrings that you break? Huh? I don't know. I just feel like males shouldn't have worn ears, especially two of them. I mean, it's not like it's it's, it's something that I would definitely not go for, as I said. But you know, can look past it. Nice. Um, I don't know what is, but my drawing done still. I mean, this is just how oh, very, very, very simple. <laughs> like, all right, so you want to review first? So I think my one's supposed to go like off the chest here. <laughs> I mean, it works. The lips nice. <laughs> I think that's one of my better traits. Okay. So, let me know. Me probably tomorrow you're not have no ear. So we kind of. This is pen, This is pending. This is pending. I'm head full of ears, sir. All right, so now we so, get that out of the way. Ready? Ready. You going first? I mean, you could go see together. See what you look like if you're ugly or you're cute. All right, one. I mean, we're not doing it together. Well, OK, I guess. Two, three. Mm -hmm. OK. No, man, we're trying on point. Gotcha. You think so? No. I mean. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so 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 now that the masks are off, would you still there? Yeah, you don't look too bad. You don't look too bad. Mm -mm. I mean, I think I can produce nice children. <laughs> so that's definitely a thing. Yes, so. Definitely. So would you date me seeing that? Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. Her. Big her. her. Mm. <laughs> Apparently, when I just saw him, well, as I said before, the the earrings, I was like, hmm, look like a little party animal and. Look at something there. Kind of was a red flag for me because if it, if something as superficial as a airing, I will be a deterrent or a main conversation we have on the first date. I don't really know that I go go for me. All that I expected, no. I guess he was a little bit more. He seemed a bit more cooler than I thought. Yeah, that's the word. He seemed cooler than I thought at first. All in all, it was a good date. But before we leave, you know, we get a little something. So, something. Yeah, nothing too big, <laughs> just a little, like a little sock. No right? problem. Just give me one quick second. Alright. I mean, I really hope you like it. Thank you. It's also something you'd appreciate. Like, I saw him and I was like, oh, he's young. Seems like we can relate. I felt okay, I guess. Alright. I mean, date. Maybe it's because it's a five minute thing. We never really get into it. But probably we'll see where we'll see where it goes. Mask on, mask on, mask on, mask on, mask on.